Hello, Henry Lewis Gates. My name is Rachel Stegman, and I'm one of your top fans. I'm also a small blast from your past. 25 years ago, I was doing an internship for Dr. Corno West, and I know you've signed a lot of autographs over the years, but this one I think you might remember because it was a very different autograph. You, I only had his book for you to sign, so hopefully this, jo this jogs your memory. And you wrote, for Rachel, Cornel West is the best. So I doubt you've ever signed any other autographs like that. So maybe you just might remember. Um, anyways, I was going to school to become a civil rights attorney, which didn't happen. I found out I had to go to law school. <laughs> and so when I really thought about it, I was not going to go to law school. So I ended up literally joining the circus. I was in the circus for 25 years, a professional for 25 years, and I opened up my own school and everything. But then when COVID hit, I had to close it because of the COVID virus and we were unable to reopen. So I found myself needing a new career. For many years, I've been very into my kids' genealogy mostly. Um, my side is 100% Jewish, mix of Ashkenazi, Sephardic, and Mizrahi. But my kid's side is very multi-racial and multi-ethnic. And so a lot of Creole and stuff. So I, I actually, they're actually descendants of a king of the U tribe in Togo. They also are descendants of what you might call indigenous royalty. Um, the parts of the big names in the Wind Clan, Wind Clan and many other tribes of the, and all of the four, all five tribes basically of the Muskegee Creek Nation. So there's dozens of books about their direct ancestors. So I'm very fortunate. Um, Isle of Canes is one of them. That's about Marie Therese Coin, Marie Therese Coin Coin Metaille. And I know I'm butchering that name. It's a French name. So, um, and she's the one that was the descendant, uh, granddaughter of the king of the U tribe. Anyways, I, um, I wanted to ask a question. Because this is such a new field of study, I found some programs that are genealogy programs, but I want to specifically go into genetic genealogy. So I'm wondering if there's any way you can help me get a mentor or somebody that could talk to me and help me uh, figure out what the steps are. I spend multiple hours a day every day on GEDmatch. Um, I love doing, dealing with the numbers and uh, plugging in the numbers and figuring out and going to the trees and, and finding the correlations. And I found a lot of amazing, I have had a lot of amazing finds. So um, I would like some professional training. So, so that's where, um, what I'm hoping to be able to get some advice from you. So thank you very much. And I'm so glad you came to visit us in Arizona. Thank you. Bye.